guys, welcome to another video. 10 TPO today. This is what we're doing. <laughs> Can you hear the insanity that is going on this morning? Seriously? I tell myself every day, I'm gonna wake up before the girls, I'm gonna do all the things, and you know, it's gonna be great. And every morning, I find <laughs> that they will just wake up earlier and earlier and yeah, or they won't sleep. Or like they'll be like, last night Iris was just, I think she kept having like nightmares or something. She just kept crying and waking up in her sleep and not, she just wouldn't calm down really uh, until like 4 a.m. in the morning, the joys of it. But yeah, I'm always like, I'm gonna get up early. I'm gonna do all the things. And then, do you hear her banging? She's, she's banging in her kitchen. She says it needs fixing. I can't even. I can't even. It's like <laughs> our mornings just start straight off insanity. What can I say? Uh, I will say it's still very summery in weather, like it's really hot. So I feel like they're in summer mode still, to be honest. One, two, three, four, five. I feel dinner. <laughs> She's serving food for her sister. Very cute. That's Iris. Okay, so going across. Cover yourself. My God. Okay. Um. So yeah, I'm all about trying to get up early and trying to. I want to work on our morning routine basically, but it is still very summerish in weather. I feel that once it starts getting a bit more like autumny, wintry, that's when we will hopefully fall into a bit of a better schedule because right now it's it's hot and when it's hot I feel like you can't yeah anyway I I am feeling very good today I'm feeling good a bit tired a bit like I, I did not get a good night's sleep I like I did not it's just it's a thing but I'm feeling a lot better mentally <laughs> I'm in a in a better place <laughs> you know um and I will say every time I step on that scale and it's lower <laughs> It just, it makes my day. I will admit to that. I I was never one of those people that was scared of getting on a scale or scared to like weigh themselves and whatnot. I never really had an issue with that. If I got on and it was much higher, I'd be like, oh, wowie, I need to, you know. <laughs> but other than that, yeah, I never really. Um, it just, it's not one of the things that affects me. I know a lot of people have like, a, a, like actual fear of getting on scales and seeing the number and whatnot. Um, so yeah, so for me right now, it is, I like it. It's like positive reinforcement <laughs> that I am, I am doing a good job. And I think um, I did have someone ask me to kind of go into more detail about like this whole thing, the weight loss and whatnot. So I'm gonna do a separate video kind of just generally talking about it because it's not just weight loss. It's kind of a full, you know, I'm, I'm working on myself. I have, I have set a goal and I'm working towards it with all my might. And it's the first time in my life that I'm actually so, like I'm actually doing it. <laughs> like I have set so many goals. Like I have set goal after goal and I just, yeah. <laughs> also, do you hear the cat? That's, that's Iris, that's not a cat. I was just told previously uh, by Angel that she needs two extra siblings, not just one. Two. She says I need to have four children. So, um, yay. Do you hear them? Can you imagine another two added to this? <laughs> what is my life? Anyway, um, I, I'm highly motivated by my children. It is a thing. I, a lot of the things I do are for my children. This time, however, when it comes to what I'm doing for me, I realized I've always been setting goals and thinking, I want to be better so I can get pregnant. I want to be better so I can have another baby. I want to be better for the girls, for a hubby, for this, for that. For like, it was always something external. And this time I've done so much like, thank you. I've just done so much work on myself. I am a work in progress. Like I am barely at the beginning. Like I barely scratched the surface. Let's be very clear. But this time I'm working towards a goal for me. <laughs> and it's, it's, yeah, I'm learning to love me. That is one of the things that I have said a while ago. Um, some of you may remember it, some, you know. So I'm gonna do a separate video talking about this more because I, I'm, I, I can ramble on, you guys know that. Because I feel like this whole pregnancy 
like TTC journey, trying to get pregnant, not getting pregnant. It's been 30 cycles. I feel like it's immediately connected to my relationship with my body and myself in general. And that's where it's kind of, you know, anyway. Anyway, we have tests to look at and I can ramble on forever. Uh, <laughs> we have a lot of flies, by the way. It's been like, September is fly season for us around here. There are so many flies, I can barely open the door without like 15 of them coming in. It is insane. I hate it. Don't know what to do about it right now. Moving on. Uh, tests, 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 tests. Okay. Strip test, then clear blue. Yes? So yeah, so I have videos coming. I'm gonna do that video. I'm gonna do a nice little video with wedding photos and whatnot, just to show you guys a little bit of, you know. Um, and yeah, we'll see where we go from there. Because that's another one of my goals, like really, really working on YouTube and actually like doing more things on YouTube than just sharing my insanity. <laughs> okay. I swear these tests make me feel blind. It makes me feel like my eyes are... No. <laughs> 10 DBO. Um... No, I'm not gonna stare at you. I'm not gonna stare. That is... That has been one rule that I have stuck to thus far, uh, the cycle. I'm not staring at the tests. I'm not, I am trying to bypass the line eyes. I'm trying. It's, yeah, <laughs> it is an effort, but yeah. <laughs> okay. And these, these are not the early detection. Someone asked in the comments, these are just like normal, like plus pregnancy tests. Um, I thought I ordered early detections, but I didn't, so. Unless they put like the wrong one or something in, I don't know. Anyway. Um, that is negative. 10 dBO negative. Um, that's okay. I mean, it is 10 dBO. We still have time. We still have time. I'm, I am in no way giving up on hope because that's just me and that's what I need to do. Um, and I will say, I feel like these tests cycle have just been like, just negative, like clear cut negative. Like there's nothing, nothing, nothing. <laughs> Hope is a big thing, really big thing. Um, yeah. Anyway, that's fine. I am gonna go check on my girls who are going completely nuts. Uh, breakfast needs to be sorted, everything needs to be sorted. And yeah, we'll see how we go. I'll see you guys tomorrow. Bye guys. <laughs>